What we have actually at Banrock is um, 1,000 hectares of floodplain and wetlands that are classified as a wetland of international importance under the Ramsar Convention. We have uh, many species of birds, frogs, um, even plants um, on site to a point that Banrock is the first hotspot for bird diversity in South Australia. From a tourism, if you want, perspective, we, uh, we build the walking trail in a way that we don't damage the environment, we avoid the historical and cultural heritage sites. Um, we have bird hides that conceal the visitor from the, the wildlife and vice versa, so people can see the, the birds without scaring them. For the vineyard operation, we have strict uh, regulation of what we can use as a treatment for the vines or uh, the way we, we produce grapes. We have to look after this environment, we've only got one chance and I think uh, if people can enjoy our wines, come here, have a lovely lunch, get out, enjoy the beautiful Riverland uh, experience, hopefully they take home something special that you can have a, a wetland centre such as this, you can have a beautiful kitchen with uh, local produce and you can enjoy some very nice wine. You have really this opportunity to lead the visitor towards into nature and um, and there are very few places like that that you can you can have this opportunity to have the visitor ex experiences the real.